वेलकम टू इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेटिक्स प्लेलिस्ट आई प्रोफेसर हितेश दुलकिया इज गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू स्किन इफेक्ट इन दिस सेशन सो फर्स्ट आई वुड लाइक टू एक्सप्लेन यू व्हाट इज स्किन इफेक्ट सी स्किन इफेक्ट एक्सप्लेन्स इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेटिक वेव एनर्जी दैट इज लाइंग ऑन द स्किन ऑफ एनी कंडक्टिंग मटीरियल सो यूल बी फाइंडिंग signals strength that is more on the skin of any conducting material and as you go inside of metal you will be finding there will be degradation of strength of signal now how that degradation of strength of signal is happening and what are the parameters on which it is depending all those things that we will be going to discuss in this session so i have already explained when electromagnetic wave that propagates in free space then basic formula for that electromagnetic wave in any conducting medium will be now see here i have written this electromagnetic electric field formula right similarly there will be magnetic field formula so i am not writing it now see here you can observe the elements where this is what amplitude right combinedly this is amplitude that we can say and this amplitude that is decreasing with respect to distance that you can see as direction of propagation is z see this z is what direction of propagation z is direction of propagation and omega is frequency so here one can clearly see with respect to distance there will be degradation in amplitude so obviously there will be maximum amplitude that is there on skin means on the surface of conducting medium and as signal goes inside that strength of signal will get weak so let me show you that so it will be more clear so see if we have a medium like this right this is a medium that we have i'm saying this is a medium and this is conducting medium right and this is free space here this is free space so free space is not lossy medium and this medium this is a conducting medium so it is a lossy medium so conducting medium that is having sigma and that is not equals to 0 right so as sigma is not equals to 0 there will be certain amount of loss and all those things that i have already discussed in my previous session now if you observe this propagation of electric field right then it will gives you clear idea let us say this is what z direction right so i'm just showing you this as axis and this is what z direction now see in free space what will happen is like this electric field if i say this is x axis then i have to say this is there in ax direction right so this electric field in free space this electric field will not decrease right but as it goes inside this conducting medium this strength of electric field that will decrease exponentially so you'll be finding that strength of electric field that you can see it is decreasing exponentially right so here see maximum strength that is there on the surface and that is getting decrease as it goes inside so this is what direction of propagation that we can say right now here there are few definitions that we need to understand see one definition is skin depth 
Now what is skin depth? Skin depth explains decrease in electric field by 1 by 8th time to the maximum of electric field. So if I say on the surface, if I say on the surface here electric field is E, right? Then you will be finding at certain instant over here, let us say this electric field is, let us say it is E0, so E0 by E. So this depth, this depth is referred as skin depth. Let us say this is delta. So this delta that is referred as skin depth, right? So skin effect explains you decrease in strength of electric field as electric field go inside of conducting medium. So we can say there is higher strength on the skin and strength is getting decreased as it goes inside. And skin depth explains magnitude of electric field eth, 1 by eth times of its initial magnitude, right? And at that position, whatever depth is there, that is referred as skin depth, right? So let me mention that here. So as per this, we can say E0 by E that is equals to as earlier I have told, this is what amplitude, right? So if I say Z is equals to delta, then amplitude will become E0 by E, right? So E0 by E is equals to E0 into E to the power minus alpha instead of Z, I need to place delta where delta is what? Skin depth. So this E0 will get cancelled and we can say this E is equals to E to the power alpha delta and if you take log at both of the side, we can say delta is equals to 1 by alpha. So attenuation constant will justify skin depth. Now I have already explained one more thing for lossy medium. We have derived value of alpha in my previous session. You can check out that where I have explained alpha for lossy medium. And value of alpha for lossy medium is square root of mu sigma omega by 2. See this is what I have derived in my previous session. You can check out. It will gives you clear idea like how I have derived it. And based on this, we can say skin depth that is square root of 2 divided by mu sigma omega. So this is one more formula which gives you idea like what is skin depth and how to calculate it. So skin depth that is depending on mu sigma and omega, right? And this sigma that is what that is conductivity mu is mu zero mu r and omega is frequency of EM wave. So by using these parameters, we can identify skin depth. I hope that you have understood this. So see ultimate thing is like we should know how signal is getting propagating and its amplitude is E0 into E to the power minus alpha Z and it is propagating along the Z direction. So in along the Z direction, you will be finding amplitude is getting decreasing. So at certain depth, it will be E0 by E and at that depth, we can say this is what skin depth and uh, if you place this Z is equals to delta where this amplitude will become E0 by E and that will result delta is equals to 1 by alpha and for lossy medium, we have derived approximated value of alpha that is square root of mu sigma omega by 2 and this will result skin depth by square root of 2 divided by mu sigma omega and this point is very essential in gate examination even. So one should know this. So many times there are so many equations which is coming based on skin effect and if you have clear understanding then definitely you will be scoring very good in gate examination as well as in entrance examination like BARC or ISRO 
So you'll be finding short questions are coming based on skin effect. I have seen so many questions. So I suggest them to uh, prefer understanding as per I'm explaining over here. And you can ask your doubts. You can place your queries. You can ask for many more topics even. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you have understood this.